Hey, it's time for Story Hour with Oma Mary. Today, we're reading a book from my friend Elliot, who lives near Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. And Elliot's mom and my daughter were really, really good friends growing up. They played together. They had a fort together. They would go tubing down the creek together. They did all kinds of things together. And Elliot likes listening to Oma Mary's stories. He chose this book that he wants me to read for him. It's called Mixed. So this one's for Elliot, who incidentally read us a story a couple weeks ago about slop. I understand Elliot likes to read books and is a very good reader for four years old. In the beginning, there were three colors. There were reds and yellows and blues. Reds were the loudest. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. I can believe that. Yellows were the brightest. Bright idea. Light bulb light up. And blues were the coolest. Everyone lived in color harmony. Everyone lived in color harmony. Until one afternoon when it read said, Reds are the best. Those reds can be loud. The yellows disagreed. No, we're the best because we're the brightest. The cool blues were too cool to even respond. The colors decided to live in separate parts of the city. Mm. That sounds a little boring to me. Yellow and blue became inseparable. Life felt so vibrant. But not all the colors were happy about it. I don't like yellow's effect on blue. Well, colors should mix. That blue isn't bright enough for yellow. But yellow and blue loved each other so much, they decided to mix. And look at that. It looks like they got married. How wonderful. Together, they created a new color. They named her green. Green was bright like yellow and calm like blue, but really she was a color all of her own. Everyone was fascinated. She's so cute. 
I've never seen anything like her before. Even the grumpy colors fell in love with green. Can I hold her? The colors began to see new possibilities. Soon other colors mixed. Next. And mixed and mixed. There were so many new colors and a lot of new names. Don't forget your glasses, Lavender. Be careful, Jade. Have fun, Amber. The old neighborhoods of Redville, Blue Town, and Yellow Heights didn't make sense anymore. Everyone wanted to live together, so they rebuilt the city. The new city was full of color. It wasn't perfect, but it was home. Thank you, Elliot, for sharing this book with us. Thank you for sending it to me so I could read it on Oma Mary Storytime. It's a great book and it's a good lesson for us to learn. I hope the rest of you have a great day.